Hello Guardians and welcome back to another video. Today I want to talk about the Iron Banner Seal and why you need to get it done as soon as you possibly can, especially this season. So first of all, let's go to the Iron Banner Seal and let's just go over the objectives real quick and then I'll talk about why you need to get this done this season. So first of all, we go for Iron Banner wins, you gotta collect some armor, and you gotta collect some weapons, and then right here you gotta earn points by completing objectives, and then you gotta complete Iron Banner challenges, reset your rank twice, and then you got to complete matches while wearing some piece of Iron Banner gear, whether that's armor or emblems or whatever. Okay, so let's talk about why you need to get this done this season. Specifically this one right here, earn points by completing objectives in Iron Banner playlist modes. The reason why this season is so much easier to complete this specific triumph over last season is because any kill you get counts as a point. Now the way this season works is there's a new game mode called Eruption. And eruption works like this. You get kills, and once you get up to a certain number of kills, you're going to get a timer on your screen. And you have to keep getting kills to extend that timer. Now, every time you get a kill while that timer is active, you're going to get a few points. And every time you get any kills, you're going to get a point or like a third of a point. So just by playing and killing opponents, you get points. Whereas last season, you had to go out and get the rift and dunk it to get points, or hold the rift, or defend your teammate who had the rift. It was a lot more complicated to get those points, and they weren't guaranteed. Whereas this season, they are guaranteed. I didn't play Iron Banner much last season because I felt like it was just a waste of time. But this season, I've only played probably 15 matches, and I'm done with this objective thing. Whereas last season, you had to play close to 50 or 60 to really get it done, because it was hard to get the objective, because there's always people stealing the rift, and you can't just streamline it and go straight for the rift every time you're going to get killed a lot so this season is just so much easier just because you get a point for every single kill you can complete this triumph super super easy all you got to do jump into iron banner you do have to complete these iron banner challenges throw on some iron banner gear and play that's all you have to do and these challenges are listed right here so you can complete four of these challenges per character so that's 12 in total which is what you need to complete the triumph and all you have to do is play the game with an arc or stasis subclass that'll change when the next iron banner event shows up in november but literally all i've had to do was play 18 matches on my hunter as arc or stasis then switch to my warlock 18 matches there arc or stasis then switch to my titan arc or stasis 18 matches and then after that all you have to do is just play until you can reset twice and you're done it's, it's that simple. There's no like super hardcore objectives or anything like that. So I really, really strongly recommend that you get this done this season because there's a strong chance that Eruption will not stay the Iron Banner game mode considering that it's switched from Rift to Eruption. They'll probably select a new game mode for next season. I also think it's really good to get it done this specific Iron Banner because at the end of the week or in the TWAB next week, we might see that Bungie didn't like the way that Eruption played and they'll say, okay, well, we had Eruption set for November, but it wasn't set in stone. So we're going to switch it up. We're going to try this game mode. And then it might be significantly harder to get those objective points. So I highly recommend you focus getting this Iron Banner seal done right now if you want it done. And if you can get it done this week, if you can't, you should be okay to get it done this season. But there is a very small chance that Bungie may switch up the game mode later in the season. Anyway, all that said... Go play Iron Banner, go enjoy it, get some kills, get some new weapons, and the seal will basically complete itself as long as you've got a piece of Iron Banner gear on. I hope you found this video helpful or entertaining. Go ahead down below and hit subscribe. We're so close to 100 subscribers, and it's it would mean so much to me if you would hit subscribe because we're really small right now, but we're growing really fast. It's only been a few weeks, and we're already at 100 subscribers, which is amazing. So thank you so much to anybody who has subscribed. I hope you all have a wonderful day, and I'll catch you all next time.